Or what's up, my cyber game? This is your first time ever clicking my video. Go by the name two times. You can call me Zay Tahu. Welcome to English, boy. Welcome back to the channel. This is your first time ever clicking my video. Go by the name two times. Make sure you join us, beautiful family, by subscribing. Today, I'm here with another video. Thank y'all for stopping by. And this is your first time ever clicking my video. Hey, just don't. Hold up. Hold no! Up. Hold up. You ain't even give me a chance to even say what the video was about. Don't click off. All right, don't be rude. Don't be rude. Give me 30 seconds. Like, no! But um, today we with another video today. Um, I promise y'all I'm not running away from the gaming videos. I just gotta work up the men, the mentality. What? The mentality, the mentality to end up even playing those games. Like Minecraft, dog. I'm even debating if I even want to put that game back on. Do you really want to know the honest answer to my true heart? To know why? Like I said in the last couple of videos, man, I died and I had a whole bunch of diamond. I lost my fortune pickaxe. I. I might start a new world. Who knows? I might start a new world. Who knows? Geometry Dash. A few moments later. I mean, it has a bitten apple on the fucking back. That's a red flag right there, dude. Like, I'm so done, bro. Oh, my goodness. If you don't hit that with a certain momentum, you're gonna die, dude. That fucking part is stupid. That game is like, nah. So, uh, today we're gonna talk about we're gonna talk about money. Um, as you know, uh people say money brings happiness. That's honestly not the truth. One of these YouTubers that I was watching, his name was Daquan, TSM Daquan. He's not playing, he's not uh what's the face? He's not uploaded anymore, but I still watch his videos. So one of his videos said, you know, uh for the root like it's not even for the root of his videos. It says it in the Bible, for the root for the love of money is the root of all evil. So it's like at the end of the day, it's how you use your money. Like you cannot love money. Like money cannot do anything. Like let's say for example, you hit the powerball or something, or you be the rich you you sell your soul to the devil, and it's just like bro. Nah. It ain't worth it like it's not worth it like yeah you like at the end of the day it's different like when you work hard for it and like you you pick god first and you like god has god has all the, the glory the god is having god brings peace and that's that's everything like money can't bring peace like yeah you can pay off for all the stuff that you want but like it, it's gonna get like it's, you're gonna feel empty like don't get me wrong like it's different like i'm i don't have all the money in the world and i want to pick god first and do all this whole process but like you got to think of it as an aspect like this right so you know you you got all this money in the world and you know it's it has to be worth something like putting god first walking your journey and and doing what you doing what's right and doing righteousness is a few moments later i Listen, man, I'm like I said, I'm finding a way to be content. It's the next day. I'm not gonna sit up here and lie. Obviously, it's the next day, but uh, uh, yeah, as I was saying in yesterday's video, um, money is it can't bring you happiness. Like, at the end of the day, like, it's different when you come from a, a different cloth. Like, it, if you just don't take the easy way out, like, if anything, I don't think that's easy. Like, it is easy as how you say it, but like, if you sell your soul to the devil that's something you can't go back from like i always said it oh my goodness this traffic sucks traffic. look at this traffic look at this bro it's 11 30 in the morning um why do we have this much traffic it's 11 30 in the morning what the freak are we doing um it's all about like legitimately i'm gonna put this in here like yeah that works uh ah, can i go go for another wave of cars come but it's all on how you use money man like at the end like if i ever was to get rich i want to bless others you know like i don't want to just keep the money to myself don't get me wrong i'm gonna keep a good amount i'm gonna put it in my savings and stockings and investments and all that but i want to give out to the poor i want to give out to my family like even people that don't even deserve it i'll just be that type of person and give them out because i want to bless them like i don't like how I hope about my videos, man. I hope that my videos help get through y'all through the tough times. Like, I don't want to just make videos just for the views. I want to make, like, I, I found my genuine passion. But, like, at the end of the day, like, like I said, I'm content on what I have. Like, I'm not the richest person on earth. I'm not the poorest person on earth. I'm content what I have. I have a car. I have a house, job. I'm content. I'm grateful. I, there's nothing less, nothing more that I want. But I want to get more for myself and my family. But at the end of the day, like, I got always said this, like, 
you got all this money in the world, you got all the you, you got all the, the money in the world, all the fame in the world, all that, that and that, it's gonna start to feel empty. It's gonna start to feel empty. It's 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 gonna start feeling like you're you're missing something and it's like our soul, like my soul is not even mine to begin with, so why the hell will I give it up to the devil? Like yes, don't get me wrong. You need money to survive in this world. But if you pick God first, everything for you will change. And like, I'm not gonna lie, I haven't put God first. Like, I even, I, I, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I, oh, this, I want y'all to know, like, regardless of not of the situation, I want y'all to know, like, I'm not gonna sit up here and lie and sugarcoat to make make my own self feel better in my own skin now i'm gonna call myself out like regardless or not yes i am a human and i need to learn to pick god first because that's the only thing that is good money is not it's how you use it and you can be you can have a lot of money and still be good but you shouldn't love money you shouldn't worship money you shouldn't be able to uh, act like you can't function without money yes i even know sometimes it gets hard but at the end of the day like you pay off every day pay off your tuition pay off your car notes pay off your house pay off your insurance pay off all your stores you gonna feel empty and it's like you need god god is the source of all he is the mediator we can't see him but we need him we need god every second we need jesus christ every second so it's like i want like i'm working and like I'm making money, you know, I'm making money from two different, two different insult, two different sites, you know. I make money from this job, I make money from my other job, and it's like I want to. I just, I it, it's a different type of hunger that you want, if that makes sense, you know. Like I don't want to just be like, yeah, there's something that I have a meaning and a passion for what I want to work for, like you know, like I'm not gonna be, I'm not, it, 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 I'm getting it out the mud. It's, it's gonna be blood, sweat, and tears, man, like. I am a living, I am a living vessel in, 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 What? What am I trying to say? I am a living being. This is a perfect example. I've been doing YouTube for 10 years, dog. Damn! Uh, 10 years. I think 2014 and it's 2024. For, no, it ain't been 10 years. It ain't even been that long. I don't even think it has 14, 15. I have. Oh my goodness. I've been doing YouTube since I was in middle school. Damn. I started my first, like, listen, I have videos and it, I'm not, it's just this type of video that I have in private. I've been doing YouTube since I was in middle school, man, since I was in seventh grade. I didn't take YouTube serious. I didn't know my passion. I didn't know my meaning. Ah, stomach. Ah, ah. My stomach. Ouch. Ouch, ouch, ouch. I'm sorry. I'm cutting this out. I'm not cutting this out. Y'all gonna see me who I am. Um, fudge, bro, my stomach. Now, what? I can't understand people like that. Why would you pull out knowing I'm going to 40 and slow me down? Why? 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 I don't understand people. Jenny, Jenna. What's wrong with people, bro? But, um,. Yeah, I'm gonna have this video out today before I go to work. Um, I just, it, it's just not worth it to me. That's just how I feel about my opinion. Like, I want to bless others. And I want to do good. And I know my, my, even like, you're not even supposed to lean on your own understanding, man. I just want to be that type of guy that, that blesses everybody in my circle. I'm not that type of person. Yes, I am a self-centered person and I am selfish sometimes. I can admit that. But at the end of the day, when it comes towards benefiting and, and, and prospering, if I have an opportunity, if God puts me in that will, puts me in his will to prosper, and help others and help myself i'll be able to do that that's the key you you can't do anything by yourself you have to do it with god that's the only way it'll work out and be successful that's the only way that's what i'm trying to push the narrative to put god first in your life to change i'm saying that for myself as well because i still haven't sometimes put him first but you know money is not everything it's not it's really not it's different when you get it when you hustle you pray about it you pick god first you go on your it's different if you put him first You'll be able to do it. You'll be able to financially be happy. You'll be able to have a happily marriage. You'll be able to have good kids. You'll be able to have a happy, like, yeah, happy home, ha happy wife, happy home, happy family. Don't sacrifice your soul. Like, don't do it. It's not even ours. God breathed his air into us, into our nostrils. God created us. He filled us up with that Holy Ghost. And to me, it's disrespectful. That's just my opinion. If I gave my soul to the devil, that's disrespectful. Who for me to say that? And it's not even my soul. You know, I'm woken up today because of him. So, just keep that in mind. I love y'all, man. It's my boy two times. Thank y'all for joining. And um, 
listen, I don't know what this is. I just end up picking up the camera and then I'm talking. I'm not going to force myself. I just end up talking today. I love y'all. I'm going to head back inside and I'm going to edit this video. Make sure y'all join this beautiful family by subscribing. That's why I always like to say a prayer at the end of the video. Obviously, I'm going to park first before I say it. But Heavenly Father, Heavenly Father, sap the Lord, the Holy One of Israel. There is no one after you. There's no one before you. There's no other God but you. There's only one God. Thank you, Heavenly Father, for waking me by grace. I know I do not deserve it. I know the things that you give me. I do not deserve it. I am a sinner saved by grace. Jesus Christ is my Lord and Savior. For the wages of sin is death, but the free gift of God is eternal life through Jesus Christ our Lord. Thank you for everything you've done. Every word that you speak is pure. You are a shield unto them that put their trust into you. I need to learn to put my trust into you. I need to learn, learn to put you first. Help me understand your word, Father. Help me understand your voice. Thank you for everything you've done. I thank you for even breathing air today. Thank you for getting me up today. Thank you for giving me things. I love you, Heavenly Father. You've done enough more than anything. Thank you for sending your beloved Son, Jesus Christ, down here for righteousness and shed his innocent blood and salvation. I know that I need to repent and I know I need to get better. Help me be the man that you want me to be. Help me learn to be a man correctly in your leeway. I want to give you my words, give you my anxiety, give you my everything because there is nothing impossible for you. Thank you, Heavenly Father, and I love you in the blood of Jesus' name. Amen.